What's going on, everybody? Hello. It's Grab Shiny, and this is Tower of Guns. Now, probably not the safest way to leave your guns lying around in the tower formation. I'd personally go with pyramids, but... Yeah, pyramids probably better. Definitely but... a good strat. So, as far as I know, this is a roguelike first-person shooter. I don't know if it's, like, roguelite, where there's going to be new upgrades every single um, thing. It kind of looked like I you could unlock yeah. new weapons. And, like, some new abilities. Oh... Oh, now the mouse is extremely sensitive. Extremely fast. I guess we're playing it fast. This is how we're playing. We're playing it so fast, you're going to die. I what was happening? We were messing with the sensitivity to... Because the menu was so slow. And we just left on default because whatever. But, uh... Because yeah, I probably could turn it up if it's still low. This is like... It's a little too fast for your, your comfort. The smallest adjustments I make... Yeah. Are pretty... Pretty... Chaotic. Yeah. Knuckles chaotic. Cool. There we go. Dude, sick. I guess these blue things level up my weapon if I collect enough. Does it does it level it up within the uh, game or like afterwards you can level it up? Oh no, I see I it over see there on the right. On the right. That's why I knew. Damn, I didn't choose the power up that gave me like triple jump or whatever. Assuming I would get a double jump. It's kind of weird. I only got a single jump. Double jump just within the realm of this seems like it would be a fantastic option. Yeah. Getting hurt. hurt. Cost weapon mm -hmm. XP. Okay. You can level so down. Want to stay strong. So just to put a little context on it, you were shooting uh, the pizzas right now? Pizza cutters, to be exact. Whoa, whoa, where whoa, the fuck whoa. Come from? <laughs> hey, you, we saw you were done with the enemies down there. We just thought we'd fucking hang out, you know? So, is the deal like you don't get any other guns? You just kind of got to play the round with this gun? Like, maybe. It's hard That's to tell. That's what it seems like. It looks like I find an item, maybe. And maybe I can switch guns if I find another one, maybe, but. Gotcha. Whoa. Oh, I thought you fell. I like the explosion effects. The little cartoony look of them. Ow. Fuck it. That thing's not even pointing the right way. <laughs> it's a little confused, you know. <laughs> look, I, don't even, I wasn't even supposed to be here today. I wasn't even supposed to come into work today. That's just the best line ever. It's because it's so, like. It's you so just real. Feel it. Yeah. it explains. Like, anytime you go into work or have to do something that you really didn't want to do in the first place. And something stupid is happening, and you're like, why? Especially after, like... Why is it buckling down? You were doing something, like, the day before or something, and you're extremely tired, and you're like, what the fuck? Fuck. I, I don't want to name any names or anything, but I remember when we were in Korea, and we had to come into work on that Saturday, or Sunday, over something stupid. Yeah. And then that guy was trying to take pictures of me, like, for the... Uh, oh, I remember. For the company Facebook or something, and that dude wasn't doing anything wrong. But yeah. it pissed me the fuck off so just much. The fact that you were there and you're just like, look, I do. It was just too much for me to handle all at once. It really irritated me. So I got like plasma saws now. Holy crap! Are you gonna beat this? I don't know. I guess I'm getting a little bit used to the sensitivity. I'm like, I'm barely moving my fucking mouse. Mouse at all. Yeah, it's one of those things. Uh, you would think in shooters. The high sensitivity is good because you can quickly hit targets, but no. At least not for your average person. I'm generally a... What the fuck? Like a low sensitivity so that way you can actually accurately uh, make your small movements. Oh god, yeah. I don't go as low as a lot of people. Mine's probably considered high, but this doesn't feel like a smooth turning. Yeah. So it kind of fucks me at the same time. This is like way too high for me though. Yeah. Like, I'm actually not sure what I go with because I do I do with like I leave my mouse on uh, 2000, which is high as fuck for a lot of people, but I uh, I just okay. lower it in the game, so a lot of times it's at yeah. some weird spot. I just like to have the option so I can switch in between stuff really quick. Oh, is that a bolster? Man, that had a skull man face on it. This is Mama Spinbot is a big boy. <laughs> This is just, this is just a tower of guns. 
<laughs> now that I think, dude, you are annihilating this thing. Mama Spinbot never stood a chance. I thought this game was supposed to be hard. Dude. Not for you. Not when you choose high sensitivity. That's how you get it I easy. didn't choose it. It chose <laughs> fucking me, I guess. It was your destiny. This is the end. This is, well, the first level. Yeah, that's yeah. tight. I got my first upgrade, which gave me more health, so my little bar extended right there. I like how the health bar is actually visible. On. Yeah. You, you'll be able to know how many uh, upgrades you've gotten to your health. Entering Foundry. I don't know. Like, it just depends. Like, bars are kind of hard to tell. Like, exactly, like, what... How much health I have left sometimes for, like, how hard something hits. And... These guys move fast. I think you would say. Um, it definitely depends on the game for me. Yeah. The only time I necessarily like life bar, like a life life bar, is is a fighting game. Like otherwise, I kind of like other ways of showing it. Like Zelda has the hearts, and like most things either do like half a heart, or you know sometimes later in the game a quarter heart, or sometimes a full heart. It's like very easily like you can figure out how much damage you can take before you die. And I got gotcha. you. That shit. Fuck that. You can't just uh, worry about the enemies. You have to, you need these upgrades. We whipped that guy's ass in the first room, but that probably just was uh, because of all the upgrades we picked up along the way. To be fair, my weapon's like maxed out too. Oh, is it? You can't even go up anymore, huh? As far as I know. Oh crap! I've collected some blues, and it won't go higher. Well, never mind then. Looks like you've got this whole thing in the bag. Fuck. What's that upgrade? I don't know. Body armor. Armor up. I guess to take less damage. That's always good. What's you know what? Excuse me? Don't just spawn in my face. Come on, guy. What the fuck am I supposed to do about that? Bro, you're just supposed to get spawned on and die. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> that, that's how we'll get him. <laughs> they won't even see it coming. Next bowls. Big ol' spiker room. Or spike room. Alright, I want. Oh, god, god damn. What'd that fire do? Pyoclasty jelly. Oh, Press it's like a, to use. like a secondary type of weapon. Okay, so it's like a fire. It's cube. gone now, unfortunately. Yeah, I think he built it up by fighting. Oh. Because it's not gone, it's still there. Short work of the foundry, yeah, dude, because I'm awesome. This kind of reminds me of the final level of Twisted Metal 3, where you're on a blip. I know we're in the top of the top of layers of the tower, that's why it looks this way, but still, something about it just gives me a Twisted Metal vibes. Twisted Metal 3, pretty shiesty game. Is it? Yeah. Oh yeah, people like black, right? People like 2, people like black. There's like this point where uh, 989 Studios just sort of took hold of a lot of their franchises and just started running them into the mud. Get out of my way, guys. I'm going straight to the boss. But you know, in Twisted Metal 4, you can play as Rob Zombie, so that's like... You know, that's a step in the right direction. Dude, Dr. Turret, dude? Do you even have an appointment here? Oh, I see. He's got like an explosion radius. You got a crit somewhere in there. Yeah, that was weird. I think that's the first time I saw that happen. Oh, well. Rapid gold game. Rapid gun, gun mod? mod. Uber. Uber sounds like it does more damage. I like it. Yeah. If there's anything SSX taught me, it's that Uber's better. Who are these enemies to fucking ruin your day if you happen to have like. Just a speck of health there. Yeah. Yeah, like, I don't even feel the need to, like, fight anybody right now. Right, because you're already good. Okay. And even if you, like, there's no there's no getting better, either. It's not like you feel like you're strong enough. You actually can't get any stronger. Maybe you could find some weapon mods and stuff, yeah. but... They'd have to be substantially better, not just a rapid-fire type of thing. Oh, that was terrifying. There was just a drop underneath you. Do I just die or...? Maybe it's not a drop like we think. Maybe there's a way to go. And that's water down there, okay. So this was the way to go. Can you jump up there? Oh, it probably it floats float you. Me? 
Right, okay. That's what I kind of thought. I was like, I don't think I jumped down from there. I jumped down from the other side. Cool. See you later. Bows? <laughs> okay. Bye, I guess. Well, screw whatever was going on in that room. It's just a, a tank in the air back there. Get in the door. Bows, the pipe organ. Problem is, a lot of this stuff is shooting it. it. It's just bouncing off the walls, and like I can't look to dodge them. I just have to kill them. It's like a weird. What's that? Oh, we dropped it. What's it do? That actually looks extremely helpful for when people are blocking our way. I will kill a few of these because I want some health back. Oh boy. Hmm. Damn. Just I just exploded and like took like all my health left. That was weird. I assume it was the guys on the left side of the stairs, but Maybe man, they hit, they hurt hard, man. But it is neat for what it is. Um, that was it. Don't forget to grab shine in your day, and we'll see you later. Peace. Bye.